when I started using Bunny Boss, one of the questions that really came to me was, I've already invested in Divi, so what happens to Divi when I install the Bunny Boss theme? So that's what we're gonna be talking about in today's video coming up. Hello everyone and welcome. So today we are going to be talking about Body Boss for Divi users. So before I begin, I'd also like to remind you that if you buy Divi using my affiliate link, you also get access to my web design formula course, a course that teaches you how to design professional looking websites with Divi. And also if you buy Body Boss, I'm in the process of creating a course that also teaches you how to use Body Boss. So you won't need to experiment and try things out. The course will just show you pretty much everything that you need to know in order for you to build your online course website. When I was uh, investigating, taking a look at which platforms to use on my online course website, I came across Body Boss. But when I uh, looked at it, it had a theme and also a child theme. So I was thinking to myself, so what's going to happen to Divi if I start using uh, the Body Boss theme? So it turns out we have a way of using Divi and it will be fully functional. And that is to use the Divi plugin. Now, I don't know if you've uh, had a look at the Divi plugin, but uh, you can also download the Divi plugin. So let's take a look uh, on uh, Elegant Themes and let me show you how you can set it up on your website. Okay, so um, over here, we're just going to go to uh, Elegant Themes here so I can log into my... Um, account and show you where everything is. So I'm just gonna log in here. And you can see here in my account area, most people we are mainly using the uh, DV theme, which we uh, we see over here. But over here on the right, we notice that we have the builder plugin. Now I know a lot of you probably don't use the builder plugin and that's mainly because the DV theme pretty much comes with everything that we need. But in these type of situations, like in this case, where we have the Buddy Boss theme, which comes in with specific features that customize our online course website, this is where we need to use the DV Builder plugin. So you may be asking, so why use the DV Builder plugin if we are already using the uh, Buddy Boss theme? Well, here's the thing. The Buddy Boss theme is not a page builder. It's just a theme that gives you a beautiful layout, a beautiful look uh, of your online course website. So you still need to use the Divi theme or the Divi Builder plugin because you need to create your landing pages. You need to create your checkout pages. That is if you're using cut flows as well. So the Divi plugin is very, very important. It's still key in this process. So let's take a look here and uh, let me show you how this would work. So you would go ahead and download uh, the Divi Builder plugin here. And once you download it, you install it as a plugin, not as a theme. Now that's very, 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 very important. All right, so over here on our website, if we come over here to appearance and themes, we notice that uh, we still have the Divi theme running as you can see here. So this is the full Divi theme. So what we need to do now, in my case, I've gone ahead and downloaded Body Boss and the Body Boss channel theme. Now you may be thinking, well, I'm just talking about the theme here. What's the big deal with Body Boss? And the main thing is Body Boss platform comes with members. So you are, you're able to see all the members uh, on the website as a student. So with that feature now, you can also send private messages or even chat between yourselves. So this does not come in default with uh, say uh, Learn Dash. So this is why, this is one of the reasons why. Uh, the other reason is photos. You can share photos on your online course website. Now this can be a really a cool feature. Let's say you have some sort of a creative online course website, perhaps maybe it's baking and people wanna share their bakes and stuff like that. This would be a fantastic feature. You also have social groups. Now, social groups is really powerful. I like social groups because it works as Facebook groups. So you know when you have to create your online course website and then have a separate group on Facebook to have your community. Now we don't need to have that because with the Buddy Boss platform, we can have our social groups on our own website. So this is one of the key features. The other one is the forums. Now, having a, uh, an online course website, you do need to have a forum and a forum is very important because this is where people get to chat and talk about, you know, different features, whatever it is, and also ask questions. Now, you notice that all these things I'm talking about, they are sitting or they reside 
on your own website. You don't have to go to a separate platform to have your community over there. Now, the other one which I find very exciting is the activity feed. In fact, I'll show you this in a moment. The activity feed is very cool because this it also works like the Facebook feed where people can go in and uh, just post some questions and uh, give an update as to what is going on. So, uh, back over here now on our site, let me show you how to set this up. So over here, you can see I haven't activated the Bloody Boss theme. So I'm just going to come over here and click on activate. So this now is going to activate the Bloody Boss theme. Okay, so there's Hi, a video that comes up here. We don't want to hear that. So let's go back over here to themes. So the order that you activate this is you first activate the, uh, the theme and then activate the child theme. Now the child theme comes with the styling and all that great stuff. So I'm gonna activate it. So this is the time where, okay, Divi has been kicked out, right? So Divi is no longer taking charge on our website. So this is where now you need to install the plugin. So to install the plugin, you come over here to plugins and then click on add new. So here you just click on upload and then you choose the file that you downloaded from membership area so that's where you upload it to and once you upload it it's all good you set it up now over here let me just go to all my plugins so i can show you where my plugin is so the dv builder is here you can see here it says dv builder i'll hit activate now once activated uh, i can use it as normal pretty much just like any other way that i would on my website so let's head over here to a new page so i'm just going to click on add new and uh, let's just call this page um, perhaps maybe even landing because let's just say we want to build a landing page for a specific course so i'm just going to say landing then i can go to use Diffy builder so all the features that we normally have when we use the DV theme is pretty much still available. So it's really, really cool that uh, we can still use the DV Builder plugin alongside the Buddy Boss theme. So over here, let's say I want to use a pre-made layout just to save us time. I'm just going to go ahead and use any of these layouts that we have here. And we can just say this is the layout that we would like to use for our landing page. So I'm just going to say use this layout. Now, these landing pages, it's not just exclusive to landing pages. We can also create a, your dashboard. You can create any other pages on your site. So as I mentioned before, the Body Boss theme and child theme just gives us the styling. So as you can see here, we have our landing page. So what I can do now is I can hit publish. Now I can, I know I have this feature here, which shows that when you're logged in, you can see this side panel here. You can disable that or you can do whatever you want with it. Now notice that here on this landing page, if we go to edit page, we can also make a few adjustments here. And that is over here on our page, we can choose our different templates. So let's say I need a uh, full screen page or full width content. Okay, so over here, if you go to your page attributes, you can control what your page looks like here. So you can go for a full screen page. You can go with the default uh, template. You can also go with the full width content. So you can play around with these and then see what sort of layout you want with these pages. So let's just take a quick preview of this page that we've just created. And as you can see here, this is our layout and it has all the elements that we need for our landing page. So all I have to do if I need to go in and make some changes to it, I can just click here on enable visual builder and I'll just use Divi the normal way that I would use it. So all your other inside pages, like uh, let's say your contact page, it could be perhaps your landing pages, your checkout pages, your upsells, downsells, if you're using cart flows, you can, they can all now be designed using Divi as opposed to just using Gutenberg. So this is how you want to use your Buddy Boss theme with the Divi Builder plugin. All right, so uh, before we finalize this video, I'd like to remind you that if you're new to this channel, please hit subscribe and hit the bell notification. By doing so, you'll be notified when I release new tutorials. Until next time, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.